What's going on guys? Penguin Derby here with another video. Uh, this time I'm doing some Madden 12 action on my superstar player, Tyrone Biggums. Um, <laughs> I'm a halfback on the Denver Broncos and second game of the season we're going against the Cincinnati Bengals and uh, last time we beat the we beat the Raiders 28 to 14 so hopefully we can do alright and I'm a bit congested but I I really wanted to do this video explain a few things um, alright so my friend uh, recently he got an Elgato capture card and he's been doing live streaming and everything and I've been wanting to get this YouTube thing for a long time now and my birthday's in about a week and um... well exactly a week from today um, so I'm asking for a capture card for my birthday and this might be the last video I do with my camera so I'm just gonna go ahead and kick it off huh? like what I did there kick it off football shut up okay but um... just kick off the camera thing with a uh, bit of football and with my character Tyrone Biggums, um, he's fast as crap, man. Like this guy's a freaking rocket. Um, so yeah, been having a good time on this my player thing. <laughs> Tyrone Biggums, freaking love that name. I, th I just think it's hilarious. So yeah, I've been I've just been dominating on the field with this character. But anyways, I just got really off track. But. Uh, my friend recently got a capture card, and like I said, I want to get one, and uh, he, him getting one kind of made me realize that I, I better get it soon, because uh, I'm, getting, I'm getting tired of this camera thing. Um, it's very inconsistent with videos. Uh, I'm just lack of confidence in making videos just because of all the pain of setting everything up and everything, so I think... I think I should be good to go whenever I get my capture card and everything, live streaming and whatnot, making videos, having fun. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to clear that up for a minute there. Um, that within the next week, hopefully I'll be recording, um, you know, all that stuff. So, let's go ahead and get this game underway. Sim to my player on the field. And we're at our home turf tonight. Uh, here in Denver, I actually was at the. Um, <laughs> there, there's Tyrone Biggums right there, but I was actually at this uh, stadium during the summer. I went to a Broncos training camp and they were having a scrimmage, but it got rained out, so that that was unfortunate. But um, the Broncos had a really good start to this season. Uh, freaking beat the beat the Ravens 49-27. Manning was a monster. Had seven touchdown passes in one game. I think he set some sort of record, I think, for that. Uh, well, not some sort, but the passing touchdowns in one game. I think he beat that record, I'm not too sure. But, um, man, I'm just really happy that football season's finally underway. Uh, this is something I look forward to almost every year. So, dang, man, I'm not getting any good drives uh, like I usually do with Tyrone. Uh, but I'm number 25. <laughs> and if you don't know who Tyrone Biggums is, it's a, a skit that Dave Chappelle did on the Chappelle show I think uh, it, it's really funny but I just really derped up that score I and mean, that drive for our team um, but yeah Tyrone Biggums is like just hilarious Tyrone Biggums uh, <laughs> but yeah um, I also wanted to if you're watching this give my buddy Jared or Jay Cantrell man a shout out for his YouTube channel and Twitch channel um, be sure to check him out guys he's He's, uh, he's just started YouTube and Twitch, all that stuff. Oh, dang, look at me go. Look at me go. I think this is a TD all the way, baby. Wait, who got the flag? Let's see. On the offense, crap. So they'll put me putting us back at the 38-yard line. But anyways, my buddy Jared, um, he's already having a great time with his capture card and everything. He got an Elgato and a uh, blue snowball mic. And... Uh, his quality is really good. He's really good at commentating so far. Uh, he's a really good player. Um, we've had fun streaming already. Uh, uh, he has, and he's invited me to some, and it's it's been a really good time. So I really cannot wait to see if I get it. Um, but yeah, uh, you guys definitely need to check him out if you are watching this. Like I said, millions of times already. 
but please do him a favor and give him a chance or whatever. And uh, yeah, let's just get back to talking about football, man. Uh, freaking, I'm happy that Green Bay lost. Oh wait, yeah, they lost to Forty Niners, I believe. Um, but I'm I'm just so happy they lost. <laughs> and uh, let's see, other teams I don't like. I don't like the Raiders, not one bit. Raiders, I hate their fans, I hate the team, I hate everything about them. They're rivals to the Broncos, their fans are rivals to me, you know, just, they, <laughs> I don't get along with them. Um, it's kind of funny, because my, my neighbors in Colorado, like whenever I go up to my grandma's house, uh, my neighbors are hardcore Raiders fans, and we're always giving each other hard times about football and everything when I'm out there, so, it's pretty funny, but yeah, me and, uh, me and Raiders fans, we don't we don't get along too well. <laughs> and um, yeah, I, I just really hope the Broncos are gonna do well this year. I I mean they've already got an amazing start against the Ravens. Kinda got their revenge from last year, but last year, let's be honest, okay, um, Manning shouldn't uh, they shouldn't have gone with that play. The head coach, um, John Fox definitely shouldn't have called that play. Um, kinda threw the ball in that situation not a smart play I mean I'm not in the NFL or anything but I mean I think that's just kind of you know kind of common sense or whatever you know that wasn't very smart to throw the ball um, especially in that situation and with that much time left on the clock I honestly think that was uh, all the Broncos fault for for losing that game and nothing else um, yeah, just definitely the results of last year's game in the playoffs pissed me off a ton. And uh, this year, coming back at him, we've got Wes Welker now. We've got like a Peyton Manning. We've had him last year, but we're, uh, Broncos are becoming a really good team. But I'm also really mad that um, Von Miller. Um, I'm really mad that he did the uh, illegal substances that he did. Um, kind of upset with that. He's missing the first six games of the season. That's that. Uh, well, it didn't have an impact on the on Thursday's game, but it it definitely could here in the uh, here in the future. I don't know, but I'm definitely hoping that he's going to be making a. Re I mean, that he's going to be doing well this season when he makes his return. And uh, I don't know. I just. Uh, I'm really happy with how the Broncos played on Thursday night. And uh, this Sunday, um, it's going to be Manning versus Manning. The good old brother rivalry. Um, Broncos versus the New York Giants. I, I can't wait. Uh, I love to see this. I love to see this game. It's always a good time. Um, so, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to that. And, um, dang, Tyrone, go, go, go. Dang it. <laughs> Dang, um, but this season. Oh, another thing. Sorry, I keep on going off off topic and everything. But the Steelers lost to the Tennessee Titans, and yes, that's what I'm talking about. Go Titans! <laughs> Beat those Steelers. My stepdad's a Steelers fan, so um, kind of another little rivalry thing. <laughs> I always go for the op opposing team of the Steelers, unless of course it's like Ravens or something. I mean, not Ravens, but. Um, Raiders, something like that. Um, but yeah. Um, other than that, I'm just really happy that the football season finally underway. You know, it's always just a long way of the off season. You know, it's just like, ugh, can football be here yet? <laughs> I hate the pain of the wait. It's just horrible. Oh man, but. Jesus. Hang on, I'm getting bombarded with messages right in the middle of the video. Man, I hate people who spam just because they want to get your attention. And if you're watching this video, I don't want to talk to you anymore. God, just leave me alone. <laughs> That's pretty mean. But, oh man, just a true football fan knows the pain that I felt of the off season. Just, just the wait and... Oh man, just wanting to wanting it to start, um, wanting preseason and re wanting the regular season to be here. It takes forever, man. But 
yeah, let's let's see if we can get a good run with Tyrone Biggums. I need to definitely step up my game. And let's see what we can do. Start the play, Tebow. Oh, and another thing I hate is how I'm um I'm playing on Madden twelve and it's freaking Tim Tebow. So every time he drops back for a pass, he's always freaking just running the ball. Like like he did back in college. And I knew as soon as he got signed, like in the NFL, like I was like, this guy can't be running as much as he did for Florida uh, because that was ridiculous. Um, he was successful with it, but I just didn't think he would be that successful with uh, the rushing game as a QB in the NFL. So that's another thing that I was just so scared about him being on my Broncos. But he had a good season whenever he was, whenever he was on the Broncos, and he he made the T Boeing thing. <laughs> That was always funny, but I'm definitely glad we got rid of him. Um, I'd much rather have Peyton Manning over Tim Tebow. I don't know a single person who would want freaking Tebow over Manning, but um, honestly, I think the Broncos, Wes Welker, Peyton Manning, freaking, um, I think we're going to be great. We lost Elvis Doomerville, but that guy hated the team. Um, I don't that guy kind of makes me mad. He was a good player. He was a really good player, but he hated the team, and he wanted to be traded, which kind of made me mad, because it's like, I don't know. I don't know why that makes me mad. But I think it's going to make me sim to the end of the game. Let's see. I didn't have a very good game. No, I didn't, but that was the end of the game. But, um, yeah, I, re I just really wish that Doomerville was still on the team, but he he's certainly glad that he's off for some reason. And that's all him. Whatever. We've still got we've still got our Broncos players. We got Wes Welker, as I said like four times in this video. So happy about that. Uh, so glad that he came from the Patriots over here. Um, he's a great addition. Oh, although they dropped that punt <laughs> in like the first quarter on Thursday night. Uh, whatever, man. It's all right. I forgive him. Uh, it's just a mistake. It's what we learned from. It was honestly kind of funny now, but it <laughs> definitely pissed me off. I was like, okay, is this guy going to betray us now? Is he definitely, like, purposely messing up on his plays or what? But <laughs> that's that's kind of a stupid thought. That's definitely not what's going on, but it was just a mistake. Um, it happens, but... Um, yeah, I'm just glad that football season started. I'm happy with the Broncos. Uh, happy about their players. Happy about how they're doing. And uh, just super hyped to see how uh, the season's going to turn out. And uh, like I said, hopefully next week have a capture card. Be sure to check out my buddy. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Peace.